The legacy of this administration, this presidential administration, is going to be failure, but it's going to be failure because voters get out and elect local leaders who are going to push back and they're going to resist. My name is Larry Krasner. I'm running for district attorney in Philadelphia. District attorney is the chief law enforcement officer in Philadelphia. And we are now in a country where the United States chief law enforcement officer is Jeff Sessions. If we don't have local law enforcement who are ready to stand up to people like Jeff Sessions, then our rights are out the window. What separates me from the other candidates is that I have been pursuing civil rights for 30 years. I have not been part of the problem of locking people up and part of the problem of seeking the death penalty. I've been the one who has been opposed to the death penalty for 30 years. I've been the one in court day in and day out arguing for shorter sentences, arguing that cases be diverted, arguing that the system be ju more just and fair to poor people. Personally, I believe that there is nothing more important than reforming our criminal justice system and ending mass incarceration. And I volunteer my time because I think that Larry is our best bet for getting more people out of prison in Philadelphia. In Philadelphia, we have the highest per capita incarceration rate in the country of all the major cities, right? That's especially bad since we are, since the US is already the world leader in having the highest incarceration rate by far and away. So what we need is someone who is committed to bringing that figure down. Larry Krasner is that candidate. Larry is bringing about true reform, true change to the criminal justice system in Philadelphia. The best way to make society more just is for district attorneys to work off of a prevention model where you try to prevent crime by making sure resources are in education instead of in mass incarceration. So we have to stop criminalizing poverty, we have to focus on things that actually make us safer, such as rebuilding our public schools, such as drug treatment for people who suffer the medical condition that is addiction, such as job opportunities. We need to rebuild our society. We need to reconcile people rather than drive them apart with hate. 